He'll be the 52nd member of Wake's 1,000 point club. Baxter Bell over Moore for two. Keyshawn Woods, mid range nice. game. Nice. Six points now for Woods. Cam Wright, rise and fire. Knocks in the three. Told you. Led this team in three point baskets made last year with 81. Chaco Ortiz to Cam Wright. Nearly fumbled it away, recovers. Cam Wright, teardrop, won't go. Whoa. What a wild slam follow try by Jones. And it's uh, Scotty James, rather, who perseveres. Here's Keyshawn Woods. Little spin -a and that's a tough shot. Woods makes it look easy. Three ball in and out for Pacheco Ortiz, but how about Scotty James? Andy Manning looking for some positive minutes from a big man inside defensively. And there's the outside shooting of Ryan Kemright. You can play two or three spots. And what that what does that do? That causes matchup problems. There's Baxter Bell who can score inside. Started high. Fans here in Winston-Salem getting a little restless. Don't and Crawford put. turns it over again. James, look out to McDowell for two. I think I said he might be the most important player on the team. Well, important to me is best. I'm sorry. <laughs> Here's Baxter Bell for two. The lead stretches to 11. Game for Wake Forest. Back on the block. Mayo Baxter Bell for two. Yeah. And then I'm just going to go one inch or one foot away from where you're defending. Keyshawn Woods answers for Wake Forest, and he goes into double figures with 10 points. Better be able to step up and be that leader. He's willing to do it. Bell rejected by Moore. Ball finds him, Kem Wright for three. Basketball championships, he's an All-American three years in a row. Crawford, two and the foul for Bryant Crawford. Gotta be quick. Move the ball away from his side. Gibson gives him another chance. Crawford floats it up and in. A couple of defensive stops. There's one. Woods to Thompson, to the basket, and the follow for Brown. Theft. Olivier Saar getting ready to check in. Crawford with another steal. Crawford to the basket. Cam Wright to Williams. Williams, another offensive rebound by guess who? One out of ten from three-point land so far by the Demon Deacons. There's the back cut. Cam Wright, count it, and the foul. We go, expecting big things from him this year. Childress inside, Thompson responds. Sean D. Brown kicks it. Brown will take it, make it. Nice. And so Terrell Moore is gonna have to guard him. Cabell right past Moore, banks it in. Well, see, he stepped away from the basket that of, of Baxter Bell. Step Childress underneath, he was calling for it. Liberty didn't want to rush it up the floor too quickly. Now the shot taken and made by Pacheco Ortiz. And a half-hearted hedge from Thompson as McDowell takes and makes the three. The Flames lead is back out to 10. Liberty's largest lead so far was 12. Now oh, it's 13. Oh, Cabell up and under. Oh, don't hurt him. Wake needs a basket so bad right now. Get this crowd back in it. There's the first two of the young career of Sunday Okiki. Crawford to Woods to Crawford. Driving for two. Cam Wright, top of the key, got it. Inside, outside, spot shooter, finds his range, knocks it down from 21. Four for five from three. Woods, foot on the line, two. 
probably try to use those fouls when they make him beat him at the free throw line. Moore missing back to back front ends of the one and one. Woods on the glass, can't finish. Moore slams it Big in. Fella. Big fella. Pressure release. In other words, let him post up and kick it out. Woods to the basket. That's the, that's the effect of Moore. Good play, good recognition. Six straight points for the Deeks. Cabell, that was too easy. Ball never got out of his hands, Evan. Everybody talking, rebounding for some missed shot. McDowell for three. Oh, great ball movement. The biggest shot of his young career as a college basketball player. They're really excited about his potential. Easy two for Thompson inside. Everybody in the ACC knew that Pittsburgh was going to be in for a tough year. The Panthers dropped to 0-2, losing to Navy and Montana. A tournament on their home floor this weekend in Lynchburg. Interesting to see how they fare. And you never know, maybe Wake and Liberty will see each other again. Childress can't connect. Thompson kicks it to Crawford. The Wake's basketball team has scored more than the football team did by two. 13-point lead matches the largest of the night. And that will be the final score. The Flames 79, the Deacons 66.